Good morning, world. I woke up with something on my mind today. I haven't made a three-minute video in a long time, but I got to make this video because it's been weighing on me heavily and on my and my soul and my heart. Well, first and foremost, I want to apologize to God. I want to apologize to my parents and also to my community and also to all the leaders that I had in my life. Now, I grew up with a lot of great people who try to keep me on a straight and narrow. And I end up going to United States Marine Corps after I got out of the military. I also want to uh, apologize to my Marine Corps brothers and sisters and all the people that's combat soldiers around the world, the Army, Navy, Air Force, Marines. Now, the reason I'm saying that because once I got out of the military, I went astray. I started hustling. And at my time as a hustler, I poisoned my community. I had maybe addicted tens of thousands of people directly and directly from messing around in Michigan, Ohio, Virginia, West Virginia. Now, when I was out there hustling, it was all about me. I didn't care anything about my community. I didn't care anything about the destruction that ever going to happen. So this was in the 80s. So when I got locked up in 89, it still didn't down on me what we had destroyed, this beast that we had unleashed into our communities with the crack epidemics. Now, once I got released from prison, I realized the destruction of the black culture, Latino, Hispanic culture in our community, the poverty stricken mindset, the violence, the the the, <clears throat> the leadership in our community, what our youth is all because of people like me. I got to take responsibility and I'm asking for the community to forgive me. I know a lot of us are not going to get on here and say that they the problem. Yes, we are the problem. The people who started the crack epidemic and put their poison into our community, we are the problem. We got to take accountability for our actions. A lot of us abandoned our children. I abandoned my children when I got incarcerated. So I failed them. I abandoned my parents because me as a son, I should have never abandoned my parents because my parents didn't raise me to be criminal. And also... I gave up on my community because my community supported me, but I didn't support my community when I poisoned it. So now, people, let's sit back and think. If we are the leaders and we fell our community, where the new leadership will come from? People that have been broken, who have never had leaders, who never had structure. So now we, coming back to the community, we got to start pointing them in the right direction, telling them to get on the street corner, lead the gang activity alone. Uh, stop doing crime. Stop abusing their parents, their parents and household. Put their guns down. We got to start being leaders again because we started this district.